Hello Aries, this is Tyler DeSantis and this is your reading for Aries Sun Moon Rising for the month of February and the first card out is the Three of Wands. So going on a creative adventure or you don't even necessarily have to be going someplace, you could just be traveling within your own mind. Um, getting to the bottom of your passions, figuring out what it is that you exactly want to manifest, finding out what really lies at your true heart's desire. But the King of Cups says you're not on stable ground right now. You're in the waters. You're, it's pretty rocky, too. Not rocky, but like wavy, I guess. <laughs> but not a good wavy. It's a sad wavy, it's a mad wavy, it's a I don't understand wavy, it's a I'm not on my solid ground, I'm, I'm in my emotions, I'm in, um, mm. it's uh, being left out in the cold, it's looking um, at the cups that have fallen whether, rather than the cups that you have, it's what can you look at that's going bad, and just not think, like, don't look at them. I said that so backwards, but you are um, focusing on what you don't like instead of what you do like. It's really easy for people to figure out, oh, but the world comes in to say, you need to march the beat of your own drum. Find out what you love. Find out what you like for yourself, regardless of anyone else. Dance fucking naked. Take your coat off. Take all your clothes off. Be transparent. Like, um... Don't worry about what you don't like. Only worry about what you do like. And people are so quick to bitch about something, but so slow to speak appreciation, to speak gratitude. Gratitude needs to be your attitude. Like, you can't be in sad boy mode and this left out in the cold, I'm hungry fucking mentality and think that you're going to eat. You have to be in the world energy. You have to dance your dance. You have to walk the walk and talk the talk and be in an energy of adventures and going, ooh, be in an adventures instead of, uh, instead of, ooh, instead of being in your ego, instead of being trapped in your mind. Maybe, um, you have a lot of people around you putting a lot of ideas up in your head. And at the end of the day, that's cool. I fuck with that. Oh, and you have three fives here. Five, five, five. Five of Pentacles, five of Cups, and five of Wands. Wow. Um, at the end of the day, you have to figure out what you want for you. And think about what you want for the future. What really matters beyond all the bullshit. Ooh. This one popped and fell right here, actually. Right in the middle. But um, you have to be emotionally fulfilled all by yourself is what I think this is saying. Don't listen to anybody else. He is happy. He is chilling. He is, has all nine of his cups and he has a wall around him protecting him. But not only protecting him, it's also too like he's comfortable. It's like not everyone who is alone is lonely. It's about aloneness, like being happy in your aloneness, filling up the world with only you. It's not being lonely, though. You can be lonely and be with somebody. It's about filling whole within yourself. Mm. You got the soulmate card right here, but it's upside down. Um, six of Cups. So you've met somebody, but... Things aren't necessarily going how you want them. There's a lot of conversations going on. There's a lot in your mind right now. Maybe it's keeping you up. Maybe it's causing you to be in fights. But the King of Pentacles says, you're going to get together. The King is in his power. The King is a just leader. He is smart and intelligent and he knows how to get shit done. He's the king of the castle. He's running shit. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing harder than running the company. I guess, but it's, um... He's fulfilled. He knows what he wants. So, do you know what you want? Or... 
No, and that's why you feel so emotionally imbalanced. That's why you're focusing on the bad. That's why you're not on this adventure of beating your own drum. That's why you're not in your castle, in your power. And some of you might be, but there's a lot of this energy is like, this might be the, the breakdown for you guys. Ooh. Okay, so this is the Hierophant upside down. So this is, you're not being a leader right now when you need to be. Aries is that buyer. Aries is that fixed, um, like, it is that energy of like, mm, like getting shit done, manifesting things, working hard for it. You guys love to work and you love to save. You guys are really good at saving. Mm. Ooh. Where do you need to balance things? It can't be all work and no play. It can't be all play and no work. You have to find this happy medium and come into understanding of who need who do you need to give to and who do you need to pull back from a little bit. And this could be with your time. It don't always have to be money. It could be with your um with your emotions. It could be with your um ooh. now this winning card fell over the world and the six of cups and it says winning. You got a good thing going. Don't ruin that shit. A truth. So you might have something. You might have met somebody who you feel compatible with. You may, might have met a soulmate. You might have met somebody who came back from your past. But you're just beating yourself up. These are not wanting to pop every time they do. I don't want to catch them. Oh. Ask a fucking professional. Don't rely on your friends or the internet. Listen to a damn professional. So... Meditate. Meditate. For sure. Let's get one more. Aries Sun Rising, month of February 2019. You are giving too many fucks. Give zero. <clears throat> So, anyways, sometimes when we're in this energy of not giving a fuck, it realizes people want to fuck with you more. The more you push back, like, the more you pull back, the more people push up on you because they're like, what are you doing? Why aren't you here? What are you doing? Do you have a life? We need to fuck it up. <laughs> oh, you're doing something? Well, what, what are they doing? Like, people have nothing better to do than worry about what you're doing because everyone's trying to distract themselves from themselves. So, give zero fucks and everything you want will come to you. When you want nothing, then you have everything. So, stay in that Aries, um, stay in that energy Aries and come out of the sadness. Come into this Six of Cups world card. Because this is going to be some big events taking place recently. There's going to be... You're going to get out of this energy and you're going to flow into the more... You're going to flip this Hierophant card. You're going to flip this King of Cups. And you're going to be in these happy energies. So, but check out my website, tylerdesantiscout.com. Check out my website um, with my art, vlogs, book a tarot reading. Um, like, share, subscribe, comment. And see you in March. Love you guys. Bye.